Hi everyone, welcome back to FS22. Today guys, we're going to be heading out snow plowing. Overnight we got over 12 inches of snow here, it's pretty heavy snow. So we will have our work cut out as we plow driveways and commercial parking lots. You guys might be asking as well, Square, why are you snow plowing at the end of September? Well, hey, winter is just around the corner, and I thought I would do a video because I'm really looking forward to it. But today, guys, we are going to be using my 2020 GMC 3500. It's a regular cab long bed. I have a Western Star wide out snow plow out front. And around back, I do have a salt spreader. It's currently empty since I did a salt run late last night here. But let's get the truck warmed up for a few minutes. And let me double check my schedule of all the driveways that have to be cleared. Like always, guys, there's a full mods list link down below. And if you end up enjoying today's video, hit that like button. It is much appreciated. All right, guys, let's get the strobe lights going here. Now, with this truck, I have it fully equipped for snow plowing. And this thing looks pretty pretty sweet here. I really do like the look of this thing. This thing is uh, going to be a great uh, work uh, horse here. We're going to get a lot of uh, driveways done, but first, we have to get our own driveway cleared out. Like I mentioned guys, I just wanted to do a throwback here to snow plowing and I'm really excited for what's to come uh, with the, the landscaping business because we have a lot of driveways to plow this upcoming season and this is a big, big money maker here for us but we got so much snow here. We're going to have to make a few extra passes. It's just coming right up over the uh, front plow which does make it quite tricky here but you guys can see, I mean, this is a pretty sweet setup, pretty common though uh, for uh, commercial uh, lots, even residential maybe minus the uh, salt spreader in the back because that is a pretty big one meant uh, for some big parking lots. All right, we got our driveway cleared out here now, guys. I actually did not get a cup of coffee, so why don't we go to the coffee shop here? I actually have the plowing account here, so I will get to plow uh, the parking lot here, and then I'll run inside and grab some coffee. I think that's a pretty good game plan uh, since, I mean, it's only like 5.30 in the morning. Definitely need coffee. All right, so we got this side plowed out here. That back parking lot is actually the other plowing company that plows the uh, market next door here. We just have to do right out front, and I'm gonna run inside here, but this truck, guys, is so maneuverable. One of the biggest things with these uh, small regular cabs is the visibility and the shorter wheelbase this does have here, and I think that makes it a little bit more maneuverable for us, especially uh, backing up and just doing all the different uh, maneuvers, uh, trying to uh, uh, push snow. All right, let's run inside really quickly here. I'm also gonna grab a quick snack that I can have as I'm plowing. A nice warm cup of coffee here and a chocolate chip muffin is my go-to here, one of my favorites. And one thing I do want to fold in those wings here, it's a pretty wide plow, almost 12 feet wide at its uh, biggest and uh, I believe about nine and a half feet. So that's why I really wanna make sure we have those wings uh, put in that way we aren't taking out our cars we're going down the roadway here but up next is this pretty big driveway this is going to be a little tricky here but let's see here we'll just do nice and slow and get this driveway plowed
Just finishing up the fourth driveway here. Now, it seems like there's quite a bit of traffic today that I'm trying to be super careful of here because sometimes uh, cars just don't wait for you here. With the slippery conditions, you could run into an accident in here. So we have to be pretty cautious here. That's part of just being a plow truck driver. But like I mentioned, guys, I'm super, super excited for this winter here. Hopefully, I could get some real life uh, snow plowing, maybe some snow blowing videos. I think would be a lot of fun here. But here in Farm Sim, we are going to have a lot of fun pushing snow. All right, with this driveway, I'm going to hop out here. I'm just going to quickly shovel here. This is a lot of snow. It's about 12 inches. In some parts, it seems to be heavy. In other parts, it just seems to be almost kind of just a very light snow here, which is good. Uh, but I think that mixture of the two is not too bad. It looks like there's a few crews out plowing snow here. Some of the parking lots seem to be getting a little bit of clearing so far. Like, oh yeah, look at that, the John Deere dealership, uh, it looks really nice and clean. Oh yeah, look at that, tractor supply. Wow, there's even customers in the parking lot there, so uh, there are definitely other plow companies out uh, making money uh, pushing snow. We're going to be doing this pretty big commercial lot here, and... Uh, there's uh, quite a bit to this parking lot here with the storage around back here. So we just have a lot of plowing to do. And we're going to be making some pretty big snow piles here. Right about there should be good here. That's a school. Uh, so we have to be careful not to push the snow into another property. Part of my game plan, guys, is just to get the majority of the snow pushed back to the pile. And now I'm doing some cleanup passes here. I think that sometimes that's the way to do it, just to get the majority of the snow. Because uh, uh, you can't really do this in one pass and be a, a nice and clean. And I want to do a nice quality job here, but there's just so much snow. There's more snow on the way. And wow, this is quite exciting here. But you guys can see, I mean, having a diesel, uh, especially this Duramax here, is the way to go here. That extra torque down low with the engine is is what really makes the diesel so popular here with snow pounds. So we got that done. We just have to do a pass behind the shop here. That way, they could get to the uh, doors here. Yeah, we'll make a few passes to really get this a little bit more opened up than what uh, uh, already is. All right, we got the back and the side all cleaned up. So we just have a little bit to do out front here. There are some customers in the parking lot here. So we do want to make sure we don't uh, trade paint with any of their cars here. Let's see if we get those plowed out really quickly. Oh, yeah, staying within a foot. It even uh, makes me a bit nervous here because those are expensive cars. There, Yeah, it looks to be pretty luxurious. And we definitely don't want to be uh, paying uh, to fix the car bill by sliding into it. Guys, I'm running low on camera battery, so I'm going to call it here for today's video. And I'm going to finish up. I have about four or five more driveways to do. But until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned for next one. And subscribe for more.